artist and animator um, working on Cherokee Street. So uh, I have a background here and I'm just going to do a really uh, quick example of a character animation. Uh, my setup is a digital video camera on a uh, copy stand, then with this handy dandy animation platform built by my boyfriend. I've got my computer and then a firewire hooking up to my video camera. And so this allows me to do stop motion animation. And so for my animations, I'm working at about 15 frames per second. So that's 15 pictures for every second of animation you see. So I'm going to start by just taking a few establishing shots. And the nice thing about this software is it allows me to see things live. That's why I'm working with the video camera. All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some kind of slight change in my puppet. And I've got a puppet here that's just basically construction paper and colored pencil. And then I've used all these little uh, scrapbooking hinges to create joints. This tiger is in the trailer, actually. And it was for this like nice part of the story where they were talking about like good and evil and this woman. I guess at the funeral cookie the story was that there are two tigers inside of you. One is good and one is evil one you get to pick which one you listen to. And so I really loved that that image of the, the two tigers. Alright, so I'm gonna just play with a minute with trying to do a little bit of a walk with this tiger. Walk cycles are one of the hardest things to do because uh, I couldn't believe how many pieces, parts of our bodies are moving during a walk cycle. So I'm doing very slow movements and I'm shooting two pictures at a time. That's called shoot and twos. And whenever I do a walk cycle, you have to try and you have to kind of remember what the last thing you moved was. Just test this so far. It's also important for me to look at my animation as I go to see what kind of motion I'm getting. Okay, so you can kind of see this is what I have so far. <laughs> animation is very time consuming, but rewarding. <laughs> Thank you.